There are people in this world who would have you believe that art is not important to our society. Well, it's obvious those people have not been a part of something like what is happening here at St. Paul Evangelical Lutheran Church. What happens when nine volunteers get together with a mission? This, this, and even this. Members of the St. Paul Evangelical Lutheran Church have spent the last five weeks, 25 hours a week, helping their church, well at least its rooms, stand out from those around it by painting religious murals on the building's walls. But what was the motivation behind this project? Last summer our Sunday school teachers were burnt out and attendance was dropping and we wanted something to just pump life into our program and to show our kids and our adults that coming to church can be fun and laid back. It's, it doesn't have to be something dreary. So we picked a theme for each Sunday school classroom, decorated over the top, spent five or six weeks last summer doing all those rooms and then this summer decided to do this project and pull it all together. The group of volunteers finish up this week as they aim at unveiling the artwork next week at their Amazing Grace Day Camp. So what did the volunteers get out of this? Evidently, more than just some painted rooms. I highly recommend it all churches to do. You don't know what's there and what you've got until you utilize it. And, and to show that, that the Bible can be fun. Um, we used humor when we named the buildings, Jonah's Fish Market, Adam's Rib Joint, and we have children and we have adults saying, well, who's Delilah? And why is Delilah's name on the barbershop? And so we get to tell the story of Delilah and why her name's on the barbershop. As you can see, it's not always about how beautiful the art turns out, but how beautiful the time is that you spend with people you care about creating something that's meaningful. From Brookside, this is Nathan Marshall reporting for 7 News.